So we all mm. know Pop Tarts are crazy good. Mm-hmm. But Elizabeth Russell from New York, she got real tight after not having enough berries in her breakfast pastry. So Elizabeth dropped Ooh. a five million dollar class action lawsuit on Kellogg's for false advertisement oh. because she believes that the strawberry <laughs> filling is mostly made of pears and apples with very few strawberries. Elizabeth also requested that they change the labeling of the box to more accurately describe the pastry filling. Oh, she also hmm. needs to add to the lawsuit that the uh, frosting doesn't reach the corners like they show on the box. So I'd like to jump yeah, in on this lawsuit if I could. Okay. I'm with you with that you one. Know, uh, Elizabeth is proof that not all heroes wear capes because there's a lot of like, you know, inaccuracies in the food space. Absolutely. You ever open a bag of chips, you think them chips going to be all the way to the top. Man. Nah. You got they like not. a third yes. of the bag of chips by the time you open Food. it up. <laughs> What if she wins this $5 million Pop-Tart lawsuit and suddenly we get more strawberries in our Pop-Tarts? We're all suing. I'm We're suing, all suing everybody. everybody. Okay, the hot no. sauce bottle ain't filled up to the top, okay? And Popeye ain't serving my eight-piece himself. What? I'm suing for mental yeah. distress. <laughs> yeah. Where's all the How come spinach in Popeye's? <laughs> I'm telling you. Hey, don't forget to hit us up on social media. We're on all these platforms at Dish Nation. We'll see you there.